Hello guys and welcome back to a brand new Disney Heroes Battle Mode video. And in today's video guys, we're going to be taking a giant look at finally getting someone up to Orange 8. So that is going to be the first time that's ever happened on YouTube, getting someone up to Orange 8 guys. So let's get right into today's video. And um, before I get into today's video guys, I want to take a look at today's fan art favourites. And pick, oh, someone's uh, someone on Lock Beast here. Whoever that is, hero. Um, let's take a scroll down and take one from the bottom. Right. There you go. The most motivational thing that you can see. No, no imitations. I don't know if that meant limitations, imitations. They both work. <laughs> then it's me photoshop them into a draft with someone pretending to be me. Uh, so basically, no one's better than anybody else is what comes from this. It's a motivational piece. So let's get into today's video with our um, fan art review, guys, uh, with our team suggestion, and it's from Hamzo Abdo. Abdo. Hamza Abdo commented. So this is this is his invasion team, but it still works. This is my invasion team, and probably going to be my main: Goofy, Nick, Ducky and Bunny. Moana uh, and Mickey Mouse. I don't have joy, I have no luck. Okay, fair enough, so I will not suggest joy. So, Goofy, once again, I don't need to explain, I don't need to dwell on Goofy too much because I talk about him every single time. Uh, he's really good. Uh, speed up, probably one of the better tanks in the game. He's definitely top tier S rank. Then we've got Nick who's phenomenal with his Lemming Rush, phenomenal with his Charm and the move where he throws three lollies. If you've got Nick fully upgraded, he's the best for Invasion. He's the best for City Watch, there's no questioning about that. It's a shame because he falls off on anything to do with PvP due to the fact that he only throws one Lemming and he has to get them up. But on City Watch and Invasion mode, Nick is definitely the best character. D Ducky and Bunny are the best characters in every single mode regardless. Um, Ducky and Bunny are just ridiculous. There's, there's no questioning about that. Their laser move kills everyone. Moana works really well with Nick and Ducky and Bunny for speeding them up. And Mickey Mouse. So the only thing I suggest is getting rid of Mickey Mouse and Miguel. Because uh, I've been using Miguel a lot recently and I've noticed how much of a brilliant medic Miguel actually is. So I'd recommend that you get rid of everything there. Uh, get rid of Mickey Mouse and put Miguel on just because he can stun and he's got more healing for the overall team. So just do that and you'd have a brilliant team Hamza. Get rid of Mickey Mouse, pop Miguel on, brilliant team. So hopefully that will kind of make you work a little bit because in the in the Colosseum I'm on Platinum 1. I'm quite happy just to sit in Platinum 1 to be honest with you guys. That's my first team which absolutely wrecks. My second team's a little bit weaker but it's still good. I could probably have a tank on that team. Hmm. I've got Beast to put in somewhere now. I'm going to take Nick out and put Beast on. I'm going to take Yaks out and put Nick on. And then I'm going to put Olaf on. So I, I don't feel like I need a healer in that team. Lovely. Why does it say $4? That's an awful deal though. Oh, that, they might have just reset the deals. No, they haven't. Oh, well, that's a little trash, isn't it? Let's go into the crates. Oh, well, that's rubbish. I might do some hero chip crates on my brother's account because he's he's letting me use it um some of his diamonds up. So let's claim that, lovely. So uh, let's see if I can get I always try and get into the top five. So I like to try and fight a team that doesn't have Merlin on it. Okay, this This could be an interesting one. But I'd probably be absolutely smacked. So let, let's go for this one. So I'm gonna start to take Moana off for Beast. There we go, that's that's the team I want to use. Then, because I'm going to use Meg, Meg uh, will obviously always link with Bo Peep. Maybe I probably shouldn't have used Beast at that stage. But I quite like this team, because it just keeps, um, it keeps Bo Peep alive, which is, which is so good. There we go. So you can't really go wrong with that. Um, I see my trials again. So that's kind of keeping me in the top bracket. 
of um, PvP, which, which I'm quite happy about. And at the moment, I'm trying to, my next cat I want to get done is Miguel up to Orange 8. So I think I was getting these, yeah. I was getting these, what I'm gonna do is go boom, boom, to spend some more diamonds, get up, grade that 29 times. Ah, come on, give me some stamina, because that's what I need from these, I need stamina. And I'm doing 100 by as well, when I know the, uh, the 4 for Network contest is on. Oh my god, I literally got nothing. What's going on in the chat? Oh my god. Okay, that's a bit grim. Let's leave that out. Whoever that is, sorry for your loss. What the heck? I did not expect to see that in a Disney channel. Now, let's get right into today's um, upgrading. Finally getting someone to Orange 8 for the first time. So I'm curious to see what the gap's going to be like. Now, I do like Moana. She's kind of always my swap-off character. But let's get the promotion done here. There we go. 08 Moana. So, she's gone up by 10,000 HP. It's not too bad. Also not great. A thousand basic damage, uh, just over a thousand skill power, and her overall power's gone up to 61,000. I wonder if that's going to put me in the lead with her. Oh, I, I like that badge. It looks so cool, that one. So let's take a look. Yeah, so she's in the lead now. I am going to start to slowly get rid of Zerg stuff and drop Bo Peep on. Um, I might... Uh, can I get that? I've got one. As soon as we get to level 125, I can get Gashin up. I'm cut, and I can also get um, Bo Peep up and get to 125, um, and that's going to be 125 as well. I'm currently getting the rest of Miguel stuff, but it takes ages. So I'm just kind of working on one, two, three, four. Uh, I need to do Meg as well, but I'm also kind of just doing Beast as well, just so I've got a nice ensemble of people to level up. So what I want to do here is go into Invasion and see how far through we can get, guys. I'm keeping this team because I believe they all need their collection done. Yeah, and this team full of healers is actually really good. Like, I didn't realise how good as this sort of team would be, but you can just see as, like, as I go through, they kind of can't die. I just leave on auto and let them keep healing each other. So yeah, because obviously when they get down to a character like that, it's um the only way you can kill them is I think Yak uses his fantastic move, and that's kind of the main way to take damage. So once again, it's just easy to keep pushing through and just getting everything go through. Because you, I mean, I wish you kind of got a bit more money from this stuff. That's kind of one of the main things that annoys me. So if you use Woody, then speed up. Look at that. And he's going to go mental. So just look at the damage he does. Oh, why did he go over there? I'm not sure what's happened to Gashin. He's just like, nah, this is not my battle. I'm out. What's he doing? What? Nobody was just attacking at all. Even if he was stunned, that was for too long. But I do not appreciate that. Let's continue through that. I'll do some boss fights after this one because I want to see how far we free we can get. So that one was easy. The boss, what's so weird about the last one? All right, so now on the boss fights, I do like to pop Moana in um, because she's good with her shielding. So let's rework this team in a minute. Moana should be at the top. There we go. 
So this is kind of my main team. I like to swap between Marana and Beast. Um, I always like to swap between one character and Beast, basically. Okay, that's actually ridiculous when Marana speeds up. Um, Okay, I might stop working on Beast for a bit and get Mo um and continue listening because Moana shields um puts the shield on Miguel and he makes his heal like a million times. Oh um, I can none of these people be Oh they can good. Let's go put on auto here. Let's just keep Oh I couldn't even kill him in one go. That is bad. Let's go in again. I'm not happy with that result. Yeah, boys. So let's do a couple more. Uh, let's just do a free time damage just so I can rinse through this. I didn't even really think Meg does much damage. So I'm not really sure too much what she's going to do. Oh my god. Yeah, there we go. Look at that. That's just instant. So yeah, I might as well just use the rest of this on doubles just to go through. Because obviously the event ends shortly. So I might as well use everything that I clocked up on... Um, triple just to get through and give my team a little bit more of a boost on the score to get through because you, you might as well keep going so here we go boys let's go we're getting the kills there oh my god what is going on with this chat Yeah, that is awkward. That is incredibly awkward. Right. Rinsed. So that's how easy it is. I'm going to round this video up, guys, because now. I always make sure I'm on, I get to tier 4 every single time, just so I can get those badges to pop onto my characters. I wonder who's actually, um, whose characters, who I can put that on. Oh, I can put that on Bo Peep. Nice. See, I still haven't got any from Miguel, or any orange ones in general. Because I need damage for orange. For some reason, orange is just the color I don't have any badges of. So it's, it's a little bit annoying. But yeah, anyway, anyway, guys, if you've enjoyed this video, make sure you smash that like button for me and smash that subscribe button. And I'll see you all in tomorrow's video, guys. I don't know what I'm doing here. Subscribe for more.